Hey everybody, this is Ty Rowan, and we're at episode 37 of Final Fantasy 3. Now, somewhere in this town is our means to freaking find this guy. Ooh, there he is. Impresario. Maria? Are you talking to me? Sorry, my mistake. Wow, you could pass for Maria in a heartbeat. Oh boy, now I'm really in trouble. Oh, this is coming to my favorite part of this game. Celeste looks just like Maria. That's good to know. Da, da. Ooh, what's that? That person dropped it off. Person? He's the director of the operas here. Everyone just calls him Impresario. He's been in a tizzy ever since that letter arrived. Alright, well... My dear Maria, I want you for my wife. I'm coming for you, the wandering gambler. Who's this wandering what's his name? You born on a farm, son? Da 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 Oh yeah Badass incarnate again. A blackjack playing, world traveling, casino dwelling, free spirit. This is Setzer. It looks like he's got scars all over his face. And he's got what we want. That's Setzer, owner of the world's only airship. Why the Empire hasn't taken it from him yet, I don't know. If we could get that airship, we'd make the Empire in no time. Let's set up a meeting with Setzer. Let's go, go. Actually, let's talk to that guy one more time. He's probably not standing anymore because I'm an idiot. So, you're supposed to basically gather that you are you need to go to the Opera House. You look like Maria... He's coming for Maria. Let's go to Maria. And let's do it the cheap way, shall we? Uh, well, not cheap by money, but cheap... Never mind. Anytime we can skip random battles. See, I'd rather grind outside the game instead of having you guys see all the random battles. And we're here. Ah, you again. Ba -ba. I read that letter. Setzer's coming to steal her. He'll probably appear right at the climax of scene one. He loves an entrance. I don't know if I'm going to give him an accent or not. Screw it. Right, if we could only grab him then. Dear me, no, you'll ruin the performance. I'll lose my job. Then your history. This simply horrid. I want the performance to be a success. But I don't want Maria to be abducted. Oh, whack, whack, whack. The music's so infectious in this game. Well, let him grab her. <laughs> Question mark? We'll use Celeste as a decoy. After she's abducted, I'll follow him right to his airship. Uh. 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 Are you mad? As something should happen to Maria. Chase him. Get him, Locke. That's why the decoy will hide Maria somewhere safe. Come again. You said she looks like Maria, right? Ah! Now, just a minute. Celeste will be our Maria. She'll lead us to the airship. Brilliant. <laughs> well, wait, I'm a general, not some opera floozy. Oh, well, apparently she's very clumsy, too. She ran right into the bloody door. Listening in on the door. Me, me, do, re, mi, fa, <coughs> ma, re, ya. Ha, 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 ha. Not bad, Celeste. Da, 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 da. Oh, that guy. Yeah, we never saw the last of him there. Mwahaha! I'll pretend to be Susser and foil their little plan. Ooh, what's that? Wow, he's got an arm. Well, he's got eight arms, but... Let's get ready. Celeste, it's showtime! Da, 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 Come on, read it! Breaking the fourth wall there. Kind of. Bye. 
Oh, this is my favorite part of the game. Call me a romantic or hopeless romantic or just a nerd, but I love this part of the game. They actually composed the opera, I think, off of another opera, or maybe just made an opera of this one. I can't remember. So, but if you look it up on YouTube, they, they have this opera done by, uh, I believe, some Japanese symphony. It's really, really well done. The West and East. We're waging war. Draco, the West's great hero, thinks of his love, Maria. Is she safe? Is she waiting? I'm not going to talk much in this one because I just love this. And I'm not going to speak the parts where he's singing. Ah, I love it. It's pretty damn good for the SNES to try to mimic a voice. And now we're lock. I'm gonna go into the dressing room. Is everything okay? Go right ahead. Uh, why is everyone singing? <laughs> Sabin! Alright. We can't go out that way. So we gotta go this way, I guess. And he doesn't have speed shoes, so we're gonna walk slow. I'm sorry. Not changing up his equipment just for that. Da, na, 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 na. Off limits. Please turn around. Okay, I guess we don't go that way yet. Crap. Where's the exit to this damn place? Or did I actually go past it? I just didn't push the right button. <laughs> so this play is really boring. I'm lock. I'm out of here. I'll see you later. There we go. I just didn't push down. Okay, so... Walking around... No letter. Huh. And there's Celeste. And he's embarrassed. Ay ay ay, is that you? Locke, why did you help me escape back there? I once abandoned someone when she needed me. He's still red. Somewhere inside you Somewhere inside you were saving her, weren't you? That ribbon suits you. That's why she has a ribbon on for a relic. On with the show. This is a big scene in which Maria senses that something happened to Draco. You better check that score one last time. Okay, so I'm going to stop the video here. Uh, it's a little early, I know, but uh, the next part is pretty long. And I'm going to actually write down the parts that she needs to sing. I'll show you what I'm going to go through here shortly. But uh, I'll see you in the next episode, and thanks for watching. This is Ty Rollins signing off.